Quit looking at me, motherfucker. You ain't gonna let me get on that back and ride that ass, and I don't want fucking nothing to do with you. Hey, what's up my peeps? My name is Morxaton. Welcome to Let's Play Enderall. This is a total conversion mod for Skyrim. I've been watching it for a while and they finally released it just recently and it looks really fucking cool. So let's dive right into this shit. Yeah, I want to explore Enderall. This is badass shit. According to the order, Enderall was a deserted continent before Malthus Vassal settled onto it. Ooh, that looks pretty. Oh, butterfly. Oh, I caught it. Yeah, buddy. Catch me some butterflies. I like to catch the butterflies. Okay. What do we got here? Anything I can take here? Can't take any of that stuff. And one of the things I'm, I'm glad they did is they made use of Sky UI. I love this interface. It's so much nicer than the stock interface that comes with Skyrim. And it's been a while since I played Skyrim, so I'm trying to get used to the controls. Shift actually walks. T uh, left alt is my sprint. That's right. Okay, let's, what the fuck happened in this bitch? My fucker burned down and shit? Okay, I'm not going to be reading all these books, but I'll leave it up on the screen long enough where you guys could pause the video and read if you'd like. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck happened here. Can I just hop on a horse? I want to ride you! I want to ride the horse. Man, you're a dick. Yeah, what kind of, you're kind of some kind of dick, aren't you? You fucking won't let me ride your ass and shit. You can make me walk and everything, fucking dick. Quit looking at me, motherfucker. You ain't gonna let me get on that back and ride that ass, and I don't want fucking nothing to do with you. What about you? Oh yeah, go fuck yourself too. God damn horses. What is this? Okay, it's another book about meat. Is that the same book about meat? Yes, I thought so. Okay, it's kind of odd. Can I pick mushrooms? I can't pick no damn mushrooms. I don't have no damn sneak ability. Left control isn't doing shit. Well, that's weird. Maybe I'll get it later on. Maybe I'm supposed to just walk down the path and shut the fuck up already. That would be my guess. Because I don't have anything and... I don't even have Fist of Fury or nothings. So then my guess is I'm supposed to be just walking on down the path. I get distracted easily. Ooh, what's over here? I missed this over here. Oh. What is this? What about back here? Oh, wait. These stairs. I didn't even see this shit before. Oh, what's in here? Oh, it's empty barrel. Whatevers. Can I climb up on this shit? Oh, what's up there? Whoa, burning crosses. Holy shit. What kind of fucked up shit's going on around here? Teddy bears and burning crosses. Man, that's a hell of a fucking combination. I need to get the fuck out of here real quick. I ain't fucking around. Fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. What the fuck? What are you looking at, bird? Huh? You need to be my friend? And those horses won't be my friend. They're just a pair of dicks. You want to be my friend? Be my friend? You're going gonna, gonna to fuck off too and fuck... Oh, what, go... F oh, you know what? <laughs> Yourself. I'll just go up the path, I guess. Oh, what's over here? What? You ain't going to be my friend either. You fuck yourself. You guys, there's a bunch of animals that are dicks here. Dicky animals and shit. There ain't nothing up here. Stamina. I know, I know all about that. Don't be interruptings and shit. Uh, note. What? Oh, that's that deer dick again. Yeah, whoa. What are you running at me for? What the f- What's wrong with you, bro? Fuck. What? Huh? What the hell was that noise? I love the music in this game. So far when I'm here, it's pretty awesome. Oh, look, there's a dude. Oh, hey. Daddy. I didn't see you coming. The fuck? So, how did it go? Did you find it? Find what? Where are we? We're at home, silly. Where else would we be? Oh, so I must be a kid. Mom, sister, you and me. Now tell me, how did it go? Did you find it? Find what? Tell me, Daddy. What? Do, what am I looking for? No? Hmm. Pity. Maybe you're simply looking in the wrong. I place. found the chicken. Did you ever think of that? Oh, oh well. Who knows? 
Say, why don't you go inside and see if you can help Mommy with the cooking? The creator was kind to us today and sent a big fat elk right in front of my boat. All right? Okay, Daddy. I go inside, help Mama with the cookings and shits. What? Oh, he just sat down. I thought he sunk into the ground. You chickens are fucking with my heads. I want chicken for dinner, Daddy. I don't want no damn elk. I, I want chicken. I want chicken. I don't want the elk. <laughs> Whatever. Huh? Whoa. Silverware. <laughs> it glows. The fuck am I hearing? Why is that silverware so glowy? Okay. Really? I can search tomato, so. Oh. Okay. I'ma cut you fools. Aye. That's like taproot, I think, right? I can't equip the knife, it's just clutter. I wanna equip knifey. I wanna go kill these chickens. Whoa, it's dark? What? Wow. Look at that nighttime sky. Holy shit. The fuck? You just like moved all up in the sky all quick and shit, and then you stopped and like chillin'. It's like, uh, I'm just I'm just coming out here at nighttime now. I'm just gonna chill and just kinda watch. That was fucked, dude. I love the sky though. Where's mommy at? Isn't it time to go to bed now? I've just been fucking around so long, it's not even dinner time anymore. Damn. Huh? What? What are you whistling about, Daddy? You got a ton of meat in here. Tell me we're blessed by the creator. My, my, I totally forgot what a mess I left here. But I was right, wasn't I? A real gem we've got here. Well then, let's waste no more time and get to it, shall we? Well, well, Daddy. What the fuck, Daddy? You, you acted like we were, like, starving. And there's, like, meat everywhere. What the fuck, Daddy? What? Now, would you look at that? I totally forgot about them. What? They're dead. Don't you remember? You murdered them back then. Both of them. What? Hey, hey, no use crying over spilled milk, right? At least this means the there's more meat for the two of us. You still remember how to do this, right? First, off with the skin. Slice up the belly, <laughs> then out with the entrails. I ain't doing that. I'll look for a nice sharp knife in the meantime to cut off the head. I got I don't one. Think either of us wants to eat that, do we? I'm gonna cut <laughs> you with it, fool. I think you killed them. Blame that shit on me. Ah, they're all the same options. Oh, silly, what's this again? We both know that's a lie. You did it. I remember it all. This is pretty deep. First, you set this horrible fire to your sister's crib. She screamed and screamed, and Mommy heard it, but when she finally got there, nothing was left of her but burnt flesh. And... Oh, gosh... Do we really need to go through this again? You know how sad it makes me when you do this. You killed them, period. No matter how often you tell me you didn't, it changes nothing. You hear me? Nothing. Now please, let's start cooking. I'm so bloody damn hungry. Wow. Okay, so far I have to say the voice acting is phenomenal. Music's phenomenal. This story is so fucked. But it's so fucked Awesome. Jesus. Oh, by the creator's name, why are you telling these lies? Isn't it enough that you murdered us? Do you really have to bother me over and over with your stupid, pathetic, and pointless whining? You know, sometimes I wish the creator would have made me just a little less merciful. Just a little less pious. Because then... I would have realized that you were tainted by sin long before any of this had ever happened. Wow. And instead of raising you, feeding you, and loving you like a father does, I would have put you in the horse trough right after you were born. Wow. Yes, I should have killed you. I should have just killed you. Just wow. Like you killed us. See, and I knew he was dead. You think you're safe because we're all under the earth, don't you? Well, listen up, my child. You are wrong. Holy and shit. You know why? Because the dead don't forget. Do you hear me? The dead don't forget. Now, enough of this useless chatter. I'm bloody starving. Holy Bring shit. Me, you spoiled brat. Bring it to me. Bring me a nice, crisp piece of meat. 
What? Nice crisp piece of meat. Bring me a nice crisp piece of meat. Bring me a nice crisp piece of meat. Bring me a nice crisp piece of meat. Wow. The fucking hell, dude. <laughs> nice day in summer, my ass. <coughs> I'm still a little sick. <coughs> Let's begin with a question. It might sound simple to you at first, but I pray you to think about it. What distinguishes a free man from a slave? For now, however, let us start this story where another one ended three years ago. With the death of the Lightborn. For 4,000 years they had reigned over this world. Seven Arcanists, who through their magic had acquired eternal life. In a time of chaos, they gave mankind what they thought it needed most. To be ruled over with an iron-clad, fair hand. Within just one century, they united the shattered lands, and a single century later, their human origin was forgotten. They became gods, or lightborn, as they let themselves be worshipped as. Yet the longer they reigned, the louder the voices grew that accused them of tyranny. The loudest being that of Naranzul Aranthio. And he succeeded in achieving what was once thought impossible. He gathered an army, overturned the Lightborn, and gave back freedom to mankind. However, the price for this was high, because where there are gaps of power, fights erupt. As such, this world grew into what it is today. Shattered, riven, and broken into pieces. And I'm here to fix it. After I murdered my family, maybe. But all of this was merely a diversion, so that no one would notice something else. The death of the Lightborn had set something into motion, a clockwork. Having long stood still, its gears now once again slowly began to turn. This is the story of someone who wanted to be free. This is some deep shit. <laughs> now I was right, I was supposed to shut the fuck up and walk down that path, wasn't I? Ship or what? <sighs> well, sorry. That was a bit harsh. I, I'm just nervous, that's all. It was that dream again, wasn't it? Uh huh. Seriously, if we had a penny for every night since we met where you woke up screaming, we'd probably be traveling to Enderal in our own starship and. Well, not like this. Some things never change, I guess. Do you ever ask yourself if maybe you blame yourself for all of this? For what happened to your family, I mean. Let's uh, see, uh, blame myself? I don't know, maybe you, uh, those bastards from the temple killed them, not me, and I know that. Uh, that's what I'm picking. As determined as ever. I guess you're right. But, who knows, maybe everything is going to be different now. It's strange, isn't it? The way life sometimes goes. Now, if you had told me that a few weeks ago, I would have at the very least called you insane. But if the stories are true, there's no better place for a fresh start. Can you believe it? Apparently there aren't even any slaves on Enderal. It's amazing. Only this whole blind passenger thing is making my headache. I believe we're stowaways here, right? Uh, we're gonna have to uh, cough up and pay our debt. That's what I'm thinking, because that's what I'm all about. I'm about paying debts and shit. We're talking about 500 pennies here. Even if we're able to find a job over there, we will still need the money for ourselves. Don't fool yourself. What we're doing here is theft, unfortunately. But anyway, what's done is done. I just hope the Andralians are easier on Outlanders than the Neremis are. 
Your mother was a fugitive as well, wasn't she? Where exactly did she come from? You've told me a hundred times, but uh, I just keep on forgetting it. Okay. I get to create my character here. I don't know anything about these classes, or races, I mean, not classes. These are fucking races, dummy. Uh, secluded people, the inhabitants of the Belt of Kyle are said to have a reclusive mind. Kalinians are deemed as blessed businessmen, a rumor that can be ascribed to the Blue Island Coalition, which is Fine's biggest trading company and is located in Kyle. I'm guessing that's how you actually pronounce that, among other things. What about this? Start with this. Native to the swampy continent, Maya Aranath, the destruction of the land caused by decades of war forced many Eternas to escape the other countries where various destinies awaited them. Some pursued and disregarded them because of their innate magic talents. Some revered them for it. Many Eterna earned their life as traveling minstrels. Originated of the barren and steppe-like continent, Arazil, the Arazilian bear the stamp of a splitted people while the nomadic natives in the steppe maintain their path their pantheistic pan can i fucking talk pantheistic traditions the coastal inhabitants regard those as primitive and struggle for recognition as full-fledged part of the civilized world and then we have Coranians originate from the namesake desert continent, which is said to be both barren and inhospitable at the same time. It is also known as a cradle, the cradle of science, the mysticism on the culture. While many foreign countries admire Quira, Quira, whatever the fuck, Kyra, that's probably, yeah, probably it, Kyra, for its advanced culture, they are often deemed as heretical and immoral, especially on religious continents like Enderal. I'm gonna do with the Eterna. Eternas or whatever. Fucks. Cause I like me some magic and I'm gonna be slinging that shit all over the place. Okay. Well, here's where I'm gonna be skipping some shit because you don't need to see me go through all this crap. Yeah, give me some scars. I found some badass bitch. Just got back from the fucking rumbles and shits. I don't know. Hang on. Let's look. Sick maybe this. Nice simple one. Man, that's messed up. Kind of like that one. It's neat. Can I get down there? There's like, I, I don't know. I can't like get, what does this one do anyways? Yeah, I don't know. Oh yeah, see that's what I was trying to do and then scrolling wasn't working. Am I missing some shit on the other ones then? Yeah, see now the mouse wheel's working. Maybe I'm just a dumbass. There's always that. Oh, I know why, I just have to click in there. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna call her Tatera. Usually that's what I use for female names. An Eterna, right. She was one of the last of her kind to leave Maya Awanath, wasn't she? Ironic. Seems some parents pass on their fates to their children. <sighs> anyway. Whew. I'm gonna hit the hay for an hour or so. It's your turn to stand. Wait. You hear that? Shit. Uh, Someone's coming. Women nowadays just don't want a man to court them anymore. That's the problem. All right, one thing I'm gonna do real quick, I'm gonna go in settings, and I'm gonna turn the music volume down some, because I think it's a little too loud at times, but the music's awesome, so I don't want to shut it off. Okay, I think that's good. Tell you, sometimes I long for the good old days, back when I could lift a skirt nobody would bat an eye. Anyway, enough of the chit-chat. Now, where did I put that key? Oh, Blazes, what do they want down here? The lamp, quickly. Put out the lamp. Good. Now, quiet. That's to say, dude. There's a Not fucking lamp. <coughs> Our shadows are projecting over there. Smells like Vartir's balls down here. Say now, what's that chest supposed to look like? Small, with the crest of the Blue Island Coalition on it, I think. Ah, uh, yeah, right, right. Black Guardian knows what the captain wants it for this shortly before arriving. You go look upstairs. I'll see if I can find it down here. Okay. Oh shit. I don't leave us any choice. We need to do something. Quick. We're gonna get busted. You take on the old guy. I'll take the young one. Go. Really? 
Oh, that's all that's in there is a horseshoe. Someone's dead. Throw a hook to the face. Come on, Dodd. You can do it. Okay, I need to heal up. I know, but I... Come on, dick. Just just go down already. What the fuck? What the fuck? I died? I fucking died? Guys are dicks. Okay, F5, we're quick on, saving this it. shit. You can do it. Oh, I want a weapon or some shit. Damn. This old guy is tough as balls, man. Just beat him up. Punch that shit. Punch him. Yeah, punch him. Fucking steal their clothes, I don't give a fuck. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. That wasn't part of the plan. <coughs> Not at all. What in blazes are we going to do now? Yes, I Yes, of course. That I don't want to kill sense. them. One of them said it's not I don't want to kill until them. we arrive. With a little luck, no one will notice they're gone until then. Come on. Help me search. There must be a rope or something. I thought we were over the hump when we made it on board. It just can't ever be easy, can it? Hey, look, there's a rope that I don't know where I looted from. Souls, the probabilities have turned against you. What the? Who are you? Huh? The hell? You are confused by my sudden appearance, but my identity is irrelevant. As are you, dear Sirius. Unfortunately. Oh shit. What? Oh shit! Please don't tell anyone we're down here. Please. We didn't mean any harm. Th th these guys were just. You ask that I not reveal you, for your intentions were not evil, and I believe you. But sadly. It's not compassion that rules my deeds. The first beat of a wing must happen. It is the only way the probabilities will fall into place. This is the way it has to be. The way it has been for eons. I am sorry. What? The what fuck the? are you doing? Oh, no. no! What are you doing, please? The hell are you doing? We just wanted to... The fuck? We just got done fucked. After we had left Ostian, the two of you hid in the cargo and lived on our stocks. Then when Rick and Seabald found you, you gave them a beating. And all of a sudden, a veiled woman appeared and knocked you out with that, wild magic. That's what happened. Is that about it? Yes. Yes. I, I know it sounds crazy, but it's the truth. Please, my dame, we... We didn't have a choice. You've got to believe us, the war. It, we, we just wanted a second chance, that's all. A second chance. Yes, I think I understand you. You wanted to start a new life in a new land. And as my ship is one of the only ships still sailing the route since the wars, you were simply forced to board without paying. Yeah, that's it. Yes, we could work for you, you, you know? We could scrub the deck, peel potatoes, anything to pay off our debt. And as soon as we've arrived... Heartbreaking. How truly, truly heartbreaking. She's gonna kill him. But let's be honest. You did have a choice. You could have signed on like all the others did, but you didn't. Instead, you've nested on my ship like flesh maggots, enjoying the good life while my crew actually had to earn their keep. And now you're feeding me this bullshit about veiled women and wild magic? <laughs> How stupid do you think I am? I know you're kind. You are cutthroats. 
filchers. At least have the guts to admit it. What? No, 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 no. You, you're wrong. We, please, just let me explain. I. Off for this end. Shit for your explanations. If there's one thing I hate more than cowards, it's people trying to pluck my heartstrings. You two are scum, and there's only one kind of punishment for scum on my ship. Oh shit! Pull him up, Ruger. But Captain, they do it. Of course, Captain. I'm sorry, lad. You should have stayed in Narim. But you, you can't do this. Oh, believe me, I can. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I. <laughs> Okay, I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, Thought she's gonna chop off his head, though. But that. someone's woken up. Rise and shine. Tie her and her comrade together and feed them to the fish. Good luck in your new life, friend. Damn. Shit. Damn. This is so fucking deep. Wow. And the voice acting, I just love it. What is time to the day for dreaming anyway? They come from so many place. people just talk, 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 and How never does it keep to be powerless? This is about your damn pride, team. I know I'm not real. Mistake. At least not according to your definition. I know damn heart. well I need it. It's just what? Christmas. There was nothing I could do. This isn't happening. But then again, this isn't happening. What is reality and selfish fool? Now I'm glug glug glug. What? Where the fuck am I? How did I get here? Shit. Okay. Talent trees or some she is. Okay. Meditation. Oops. All right. So why did they not stab me? I don't know. That's odd. Huh? Oh. Okay, wow, this is crazy. Gotta find my way to the mainlands. Yeah, journal, G-A, H, hero, look at that. Okay, pretty cool. Anything over here and there, there, or whatever, under the waterfalls and underwater? Nothing. So how do I get to the mainland? Uh-huh, hang on, let's go back here. Mm, this way, maybe? I'm guessing I have to go around some shit. So travel the water, uh, F5, quick save this shit before I kill myself. Can I not go this way? Nope, not supposed to go that way. Maybe this way. Ooh, what's that? What? That's a Nern route. Maybe they call it differently here, but I can't swim any further than that way. So that's probably not the way to go then. Yeah, what do I look like? Am I all fucked up? I'm not stabbed or anything. Well, there's gotta be a way up somewhere. I'm just not seeing it. Climbing up some shit, maybe. Hmm, there's really nothing in the waterfalls, okay. Oh, wait, wait, what's this? Is this the pathway up? Oh, yeah, I think it's the pathway up. Wait, can I loot that? Nope. Yeah, okay, okay, this is some kind of way. Just like division. Hmm. Ooh, iron sword. Yeah, what? Ready to rumble. Ready to fuck shit up? What? What you looking at? <sighs> fuck you up. Anything else I can loot? I can't mine that shit. Really, I don't want the shovel. Fuck, drop the shovel. I don't want that shit. Nothing over here. Nada. Okay, I guess I gotta go in the ruin. Wait, what's over here? Coal. It says it's a tool. I don't know. What? The fuck is this thing? Pit rats. These guys are nasty. Fucking dicks. Scaring the shit out of me. Fuck. I didn't even see them. They just came out of nowhere. I left the inventory screen, and it's like, oh, ugh, ugh. Ooh, money, potion, empty wine bottle, chest ain't have dick in it. I don't know if I should take, nah, see, it's not, nah. I don't want that. All right, I guess I'm going in, man, my health is not so great now. Uh, do I heal slowly over time? Probably not. Only regenerates itself if you are satiated. Who am I satiated? What's my hunger at? Doesn't tell me. Going on in. Alright, F5 in this bitch. What is this? Take that. Alright. What do we got up in this bitch? 
Anything good? Raising your skills with learning books. Take the book. It's, what? Okay. Where's the book? Okay, I took the book, but I don't see it in my inventory. Oh, it's right here. It's a fucking apple. I'm looking for a book icon. Okay, sweet. Just by reading a book, I know how to fucking use the sword now. Yeah, Alright, let's collect these disgusting things. Yeah, I'll take a pickaxe. Skeletons are empty. What is that? Key. Ooh, I'm glowing purple standing here. Ooh, purple. Purple. -y. I like the purple. -y's. Purple. -y. Anything else? Nothing up here. Nothing over there. Alright, let's put the key in here. Oh shit, I might as well just stand on this one. This is gonna be the one that goes all the way up. Bring me up. Whoa. Fucking bats and shit. Motherfuckers. Okay. Which way to go? Which way to go? I'm gonna go this way first. Looks like this is gonna be a dead end or some shit. What? It's not? Alright, I'm gonna go back this way. And actually, I'm going to end the episode right here because this has been a long so far with all the cutscenes and everything. So, if you like what I'm doing, please like, comment, subscribe, and share. Really appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. Love hearing from you guys. There's links in the description below to find me on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Later. Later.